Are you looking for a satellite dish, a satellite receiver, or a actuator, or a satellite meter, or an LMB, or any satellite products for your free to air setup? Go to tech2000.com. Look at their wide variety of merchandise of many free to air satellite products that will soothe your satellite needs. satellite dish uh, with the uh, possibility if uh, to get you could probably get 25% as what it says on Tech 2000 of the North American C-band shells if you put a CKU LMB on it. We're going to unbox this thing, we're going to test it out with different LMBs and we'll see what happens. So this is the unboxing video of the dish part. So it's a bit huge box. Uh, more styrofoam. I think that's just part of the way it's shipped. Okay, yeah, this is just a giant thing here to protect the dish. Up here. So, <laughs> I'm just very excited. Always excited to get a satellite dish delivered and to look at it. So, nice little piece of foam here, just to, uh, where am I gonna put my junk pile for? I'll put it here, go back him up off the rug nicely. But this box it actually seems a little bit, in some ways it's bigger than the See the dish in there, some plywood. It's a good thing that they you know, shipped this thing the way they did. Now, I don't know if it's going things in here that were shipped with the dish. I'll take a look, look at this stuff here. Now, uh, so this is the part of the no. I'm gonna go down to Tech 2000 sometime and like get them video of them packaging these things. All right, so this is the dish kind of hangs. Uh, we'll bolt to this, or we'll bolt to this part. Probably this part here with just four points of contact, and then this thing will have where the bracket goes and your inclination. I think I don't know. I'll have to take a look at everything. We'll find out how it's all. Set all together. Put this out here. 
I probably loosened that up a bit now. That's right. One solid piece for a KU bad dish. So, housed in this wood piece here. Okay. And I'll take it off camera and I'll show you a bit of what the dish looks like as we're getting into it. Bolted together just to help so it doesn't get bent. And shipping. It's probably was packaged like this. Or it was made in. This is held together with this plywood, a little bit of cardboard, and these uh, bolts and screws here, holding it together, so keeping it secure. So we're gonna, I'm gonna take this part of this part. There's the screws along this board here. Then we'll see how the dish shipped. beauty a satellite dish and when you talk into it it bounces back at you really neat like you're like in an acoustic ah. uh, <laughs> see plainly that it is four feet but when you uh, look at it this way it's about four and maybe four inches more on the tape measure here but there on the tape measure, four foot. Uh, yeah, four foot that, and some love. So usually they're like a little bit egg shaped, I find, like these KU band dishes, but I'm in a spot here for the reflective audio. I got my beanbag chair here just to fill it up with more of this styrofoam stuff. I have another one, but it smells terrible. So just to go through here, what we have in here. All right, so here we have another pole mount. So this, uh, this pole mount in there and I'm going to peel that in here, see if we have anything else. Uh, some more brackets and accessories for the dish. This is the rod for uh, the, uh, the skew. And more brackets for uh, putting the actuator on for one of these dishes. Or brackety things go along with the dish. Always wrapped up nicely. Nice so these will be, hopefully, these are pre bent. Remember the C band dish? It was a pain trying to get these turned the right way. So hopefully, I don't have to bend these any and try to figure out how to. Get my L and B to where I need it. This foam sticks to everything. I cannot put this into con into the ground and have it not blow over. So
something is, see, is a lot more of this stuff here. So in the box, there is another box. There is a, uh, a scalar ring for uh, C-band on a small dish. This box over here for the scalar. And I have some cord. I'm gonna fill up my beanbag chair with the rest of this stuff. Oh, good. This is what uh, I, a lot of people uh, I get questions about, and this can be a great. This is a satellite dish mover. So what this will do in the bag here, it will uh, allow you to your dish to be motorized. So let's get this thing out here. So this is the motor here, and you put your dish on this mount here and it moves. Why is it a weird shape? <laughs> okay, it has a little driver. That, that's what these things are, they're little driver switches. Put them, put them over here, that's good. So, anything else in here? Nope. Other things. I have a Sat Hero. Wow! That is nice. This is a sad hero that actually has the, uh, you can see what's going on. This is nice. Oh, this makes my day. Nice. So it has an HDMI port on it. Oh, wow. Need, oh. This will be a, this will be a video review in itself. This is great. Makes things easier for setting up your dish. That's, this is the S Sat Hero 400 HD. Flat this box down. So let's see what's in this box here. And this is a, uh, a V-Box 2. So this will be for moving the dish. And I haven't received the actual dish yet. So these are just parts for, uh, for a KU bed dish. Now, you don't need this for this one, this is just separate, but I'm gonna do a review on how to set up one of these, uh, cause I get a lot of questions. Okay, awesome. This is uh, Christmas time in uh, April. <laughs> I'm so smart. Oops. Aha! Uh -huh. oh. See it in there. All right, let's get it out. Aww! The cutest thing ever. It's a little tiny actuator. So this is, will be for the uh, four, uh, four foot dish. This, some brackets here, and then the two brackets that hold the dish on. So this should be fun to set up. All right, it has a little manual for the actuator. Pretty much, I yeah, it's pretty much the same as setting up the actuator on a C-band dish, except this is like a smaller KU band dish for the setup that we're going to use for this. So we got the actuator, and of course. As I like to call this thing, this the snake! Ah! <laughs> we'll see, because I found with this this thing on the actuators, um, you can't get as much stroke with it. So we'll see what see, see what it looks like with it. Would we set it up with the dish if we want to go that route or not? So there we are. There's 
a unboxing video of that. Please like, share, and subscribe. Auto Octane YouTube channel, Twitter page, Robbie Strike 3, and for my uh, webpage, RobbieStrike.com, and my Facebook page, Robbie Strike Videos. Please go there, like, follow, share, subscribe, share the videos there with all your friends, because doing so will make you go from this. Oh! Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! 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 To this. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Yeah!